Well, it certainly can be hard to say goodbye. It's hard for us to say goodbye to John McKay, who's heading off into a happy retirement. His final show airing here tonight on Channel 8. That's right. Chris Sadegui sat down with John to look back on his career and look forward into what's next in this Daybreak Rewind. Come Friday night, the slate is clean, the pages are blank. I can't tell you that I'm not nervous. I'm certainly nervous about uh, a new chapter in, in, in my life. The chapter ending began the same way. He remembers. Uh, I believe it was June 11th. It was June of 1984. The union workers refused to take a pay cut. So the That's when a fresh face reporter from Omaha started his job in WFAA's Fort Worth newsroom. Well, sitting in for John Criswell, we're happy to have John McKay joining us again. How you doing? 35 years later, he remembers there's no story too big. 9-11 was a Tuesday. Next day was a Wednesday, and we had to drive to New York, and we got there Thursday just before the 5 o'clock news. Outside the main entry area for rescue crews... People were giving me these pieces of paper asking me if could I go inside, inside and see if their relatives were in there because they hadn't heard from their relatives. He remembers no person too small. She worked for Meals on Wheels. Fifteen kids never did go out without anything. If anybody had done without it, it was me. And so the next day, all these people showed up to help her. To, I think they gave her a car, they gave her money. So, important stuff to me. And he remembers those that came before him. Do you hear any echoes oh. when you walk in here? <laughs> oh, yeah. I, 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 I hear uh, Tracy Rowlett. I hear Chip Moody talking. I see uh, Troy Dungan uh, d during the weather. Uh, Dale was here then. He was here before me. Friday night, John McKay starts the next chapter. I, I could use the rest. <laughs> the rest of his story remains to be written, but you should remember he still has a knack for news. I understand that I'm going to be a grandfather uh, sometime right after uh, uh, right after retirement. Did you just break news with that announcement about being a, uh, a grandfather? A grandfather? About... Yeah. Uh, yeah. Did you? Yeah, yeah. That's, that's, uh, uh, everybody says, oh, does that feel bad? I said, no, I mean, I, uh, it's great. New life, blank pages and endless possibilities. But this chapter is history. One we'll all remember. History forgotten is history lost. That's our news for now. Thanks for watching. Good night.